this is Miss Jen and my friend the mouth. And today we're going to be talking about your er sound. To write the er sound, you will use the letter R. To make a good er sound, I need you to think about swallowing your tongue. What does that mean? That means pulling your tongue back as far as you can in your mouth. You've got to use all of these muscles to pull it back like you're going to swallow it. So you could do that one of two ways. You can either keep the tongue tip down and pull, pull, pull it back, use those muscles like you're gonna swallow it and keep it back there. Or you can flip your tongue tip up and pull it back as far as you can like you're gonna swallow it. That means you gotta engage all these muscles to keep it back there. If your tongue doesn't stay back there and it comes down, you're gonna have a sneaky uh sound. Ooh, that is not a good sound. Instead of saying the word bear, you're gonna say the word bear, right? What do we do with sneaky uh? We gotta take it and we gotta throw it away. To practice your sound, we're gonna walk the whole mountain. We're gonna start off in isolation, doing your sound by itself. Then we're gonna move to syllables. Next, we'll do words. And last, we'll use your sound in sentences. It's your job to try and think about using a good sound all the time when you're talking to your family or friends or while you're reading a book out loud. Some of you might start out stuck at the very top of the mountain up here, and that's okay. Our goal is to practice hard so that you can get off the mountain so you're not stuck anymore. We're gonna practice your er sound in isolation. So I want you to make two fists and we're gonna go er, er, er. Now you do it along with me. Let's go. Er, 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 er. practice at the syllable level now. I put the er sound in the middle and we're going to say it with long vowels and short vowels. I'm going to say it first and then you're going to say it right after me. Let's go. Ray. Ra. Re. Re. Ry. Ri. Row, raw, rew, ruh. All right, now we're going to go backwards. Air, r, ear, air, ire, air. Or, are, your, are. Now we're going to practice your sound at the word level. You're going to see some pictures go by, and as they go by, I want you to say the word out loud. If you don't know one of the words, feel free to pause the video and ask somebody in your house for help. Make sure to use your sound super clearly. Don't let any sneaky sounds in there. You just practice using your sound in the word level. Now we're gonna move down to the sentence level. You're gonna see some pictures with your sound in it. I want you to make me one sentence for each picture that you see. If you need to pause the video so you can make a great sentence, pause the video and then return to the next picture. 